Hey you guys, it's Amy coming to y'all with another video and as you can see from all the products on the floor, I am doing another hair routine video, regimen, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Um, basically, I'm going to start off from my pre-poo treatment, then I'm going to lead off to my moisturizing and sealing. So, let's get started. What I did today to pre-poo was I put my home health castor oil into this little bottle and it was full like halfway full so basically I just put it in this applicator bottle and I just like squeezed it like basically I used you love Meg's technique but I didn't leave it in all day I just put it in when I came home from work I'm leaving it in for an hour at the most <clears throat> and then the next step I'm going to get in the shower and use my shampoo, my moisturizing shampoo, which is Tresemme Moisture Rich Shampoo. And what I did was I put, I also put that in an applicator bottle with the little tiny tip, so I can just focus it on my scalp and massage it in, and then rinse it out. And when it runs on my ends, that's how I clean the ends. So basically, that's how I do my shampoo, and that's a moisturizing shampoo. Um. Let's see, my next step is I do my protein treatment, which today I'm going to do my Afigy Keratin 2-Minute Reconstructor, and I'm going to leave it on for at least 30 minutes, at the most an hour. So I put this in my hair, and I use it generously. Even though I have like less than half of a bottle, I'm going to use I'm gonna use the whole thing today. So I'm going to just put it on my hair and put on a plastic cap and leave it on at least 30 minutes. And um, my next part is my moisturizing conditioner, which is a bunch of different things. This is a hair mayo jar from Organic Root Stimulator. All I did was clean it out and put in my conditioners, which are Tresemme Moisture Rich Conditioner. I mean, I use that mostly in this mixture. Then I use the Great Value Products version of the Nexus U Mixtures Moisturizing Conditioner. Then I also added in vegetable glycerin, which draws moisture and like it's very liquidy, as you guys can see, it's running and all that, so it's like very runny and liquidy now. That was my moisturizing conditioner mix. Um, then the next part, I well, oh, when I do that, I also put it on a plastic cap and leave it in for at least 30 minutes to an hour at the most, and I put it on a plastic cap, like I just said. And then when it's time to come out, I just rinse it and I dry my hair like 90%. And then I go ahead and moisturize my hair. This time, I'm thinking of using this, the olive oil. Um, what is this called? It, I think it just says olive oil, um, moist, extra rich, some crap like that. But I use this. And it's safe to put it on a, on your scalp, but I think I'm going to just put it on my hair. I don't know. I don't even think I'm going to use this. I think what I'm just going to do is moisturize with um, this. And I'm going to also use it as my leave-in. It's a silk touch leave-in from Triple Moisture, Neutrogena, Triple Moisture, whatever. And I'm going to seal with um, my grapeseed oil, which I am like running through like crazy. I've had this bottle for a while. But I use oils like crazy, so and I'm probably gonna go to the vet, the vitamin shop tomorrow and get some tea tree oil because I hear that's good for putting on your scalp and stopping itching. So I think I'm gonna get that and get another applicator bottle from Sally's and just put it in there and probably put that on my scalp every other day because I just like broke my rule of like staying on my routine with some weave. I got that weave that I just showed y'all the other day. And I was like, you know what, I need to get back on my hair because I flattened my hair too many times while I had that weave. So right now I'm focusing on my hair, my real hair. And then I'm trying to get it healthy so I can put in these braids that I told y'all about the other day. So, yeah, I'm going to keep y'all posted on that and show y'all how my hair comes out after this. So bye, you guys. Talk to you later.